Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter. Welcome to your Tennis Now News Update. Indian Wells is a desert jewel for players. But what would tennis's leading ladies bring with them if they were trapped on a desert island? Former Indian Wells champion Maria Sharapova chose a true love close to her heart. Can I take my pet? <laughs> yeah, you can have a pet. Okay, I'll take my dog. Maria also showed her practical side, picking an item with a purpose. I'll take a fishing pole. I don't know much about fishing, but um, and um, something to make fire. Yeah, to cook the fish that I'm gonna catch. All right, I'm thinking way, way too far ahead. Caroline Wozniacki chose something with a sharper edge. A knife, so that, you know, I could get some food somehow and cut into trees and maybe there's some coconuts and, and stuff. And as for Anna Ivanovich, travel and entertainment topped her list. I would get a canoe, a book, and the music. And of all the ladies, Aggie Rodwanska is the lightest pecker. A mango? <laughs> in case you missed it, Serena Williams' emotional and triumphant return to Indian Wells was the big story from opening week. After a 14-year absence, fans welcomed the world number one back with open arms. Happy to see her back in the tournament for the first time since 2001, when the final was marred by jeers and boos from somebody in the crowd. This time, fans showed her the love with a standing ovation. As you can imagine, it was an emotional day for Serena and her family. Serena said she was overcome with emotion by the crowd's reception, which she says reaffirmed her decision to return. I think they were tears of, of overwhelm. They were just overwhelming. I, at that moment, I everything had just, I just felt so good to be out there. I felt like I, I made the right decision and I knew I wanted to do it. I knew that I really wanted to do it, but up until that moment, uh, I didn't really know if it was the right thing for me to do. And I feel like that's when I felt it was the right thing and receiving the love from the crowd here, it really meant a lot to me. Lots of familiar faces on hand for Serena's comeback, a match she won, and then she met with some fans. We could see some All-American fireworks in the round of 16 where Serena will square off against Sloane Stephens for the first time since 2013 in the fourth round of the U.S. Open. You might recall that these two ladies had a bit of a falling out on social media after Sloane beat a hobbled Serena in the 2013 Australian Open quarterfinals. Sloane was upset that Serena stopped following her on Twitter and said Serena was not a true mentor. Well, both ladies have downplayed any lingering bad feelings from that feud, and Williams says she thinks Stevens is playing really well these days, and she expects a very tough match. Serena says it's exciting to see young African-American players like Stevens, Madison Keys, and Taylor Townsend making their mark and following in the footsteps of the Williams sisters. A champion's work isn't only confined to the tennis court. Rafa Nadal gets the rock star treatment before his first match at Indian Wells. And even after Rafa's second round win, the balls keep flying in his direction. Next up for Rafa is an all-lefty matchup with American Donald Young. A couple of weeks ago, we brought you Novak Djokovic giving a belly dancer a run for her money. Well, we all know Novak likes to have a bit of fun. So since then, we've seen the Joker strap on point shoes and pirouette with his wife, Yelena. He says couples that dance together stay together. Of course, it gives you, it gives you that great posture and it allows you to, to have this gracious movements uh, combined with a, with a beautiful music. And, and of course, you're spending the quality time with your loved one. What, what else can you ask for? We're gonna leave you with one of the most exciting exchanges from week one in Indian Wells. Here's Grigor Dimitrov and Nick Kyrgios going nose to nose at the net in this awesome point. That's the news for now. We'll see you next time on Tennis Now.